Okay, so today my Artis Opus brushes have arrived. It's got the customs and the international blah 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 tracking and all the Artist Opus things. The box is kind of mashed a little bit. There's only one set of brushes and a palette in here. Uh, so hopefully nothing got smashed or damaged. Shipping took a little over a month, month and a half I think. I expected this to take much longer to get here. So pleasantly surprised today when I got a knock on the door from the mailman. My desk is so so messy. I've got so much stuff going on. I need to finish up some of these projects. This one's gonna take a while. But I got these other ones. They gave me an Artis Opus pen. Mmm. Fancy. The palette, the textured palette. They actually sent me an email a while back saying that this was uh, way on back order. I guess those are burn marks from the laser cut. It's all got texture on it. It's pretty cool. I like it. It's, uh, I don't know if I'm going to end up using it or not. I kind of just like it the way it is. I may end up painting it a little bit, use it for that. Do some other stuff on there. Oh, a sticker! Ooh. Eh. Artis Opus. Basic sticker. <clears throat> you guys can do a little bit better on the sticker. I'm just saying. Your painters. This is the best that the painters could come up with is your, your logo. Come on, guys. Alright. So. Gracefully get rid of that. And here we go. Now these are the Series D. I have a set of Series S over here. They're actually up here. I bought these were I, I got local at my local hobby shop. I was looking for these. Literally what got me into all of this was this little guy right here. Watching the video on how to paint this. And I've gotten this, put it together, primed it, and it's been sitting over there ever since. And I added a comment on the video of watching artist, one of the artists at Artist Opus uh, painting this. And he did the whole dry brushing video. You should go check it out if you haven't looked at it. It's The guy's phenomenal. Just dry brushing with gray, black, and white. And it, it, it came out, I was just dumbfounded how good that came out. Uh, and I've commented on there that, man, you should... You know, where'd you get the model? And you should uh, make it to where people can get the model and then follow your video, blah, blah, blah. And I never expected it. And he actually responded to it and told me these are Star Wars. I never even knew any of Star Wars Legions existed. Uh, so <clears throat> I ended up finding it at my lo local hobby shop, Valhalla's Gate in Columbia Mo. Um, you should go check those guys out if you're in the area. It's pretty cool. They've actually tripled their size. If you're a board gaming type person, you can actually go there and play because uh, they have all the facilities and all that for for playing. So, here we go. Our Series D Q Seed. Oh, look at that. They're so beautiful. Got the awesome wooden case with them. All the dry brushing brushes. I thought this was going to be a lot bigger than this, to be honest. In the video, it looks much bigger than what that is. I'm holding that like a... Yes. Yes, I used to smoke. No more. But see, I thought this was going to be more... the Not the, the size of the brush, but this, uh, the bristle, I guess. Get out of there. Come here. But if you know, like this is one of the cheap 
trash. I use this one for like uh, anything but uh, what a paintbrush is supposed to be used for. Anyway, I thought the the size would be like that. This is a little bit bigger, a little bit fatter. Um, obviously, the bristles are massive. I knew that the... Ooh, those feel real soft and nice. I like that. Those are extremely nice. I've got these ones over here from... Uh, these are... Yeah, that's so small I can't even read it. Something's touched. I got these at uh, Hobby Lobby. And these bristles are extremely firm. If they, they literally feel like fishing line. A very fine, fine fishing line is what that feels like. And they're very firm, very, very bristly. Bristly? There's a new word for it. But this, this is like, this is like baby duck. That's how nice and soft that is. That is awesome. Anyway. So, there we have it. The Series D comes with the... This is for... Uh, if I'm not mistaken, you can add a little bit of water into this and use this. The way the video explained, you put like a, a drop or two of water here, add it in here, and then you can use this to help thin out your paint. <clears throat> so even this is cool. The fact that this has got a, a nicely wood, uh, a nicely wood, a nice wooden screw top that I can't seem to, there we go. Nope. Wow. Really? Okay, come on. That's weird. Anyway, I'll have to remember that. It's much tighter on this side than it is on this side. But anyway, that's what that's for. Got another thing of uh, brush conditioner, I believe this is. I've got... Come here. To the Series S. Now I've got a D. It's funny because my first name starts with D and my last name... And starts with S. So there's my initials right there. My real name. It's about the only time you'll ever hear or see that. So there you go. <clears throat> anyway. I'm very excited about this. The case is beautiful. Everything about these is, is gorgeous. Even down to the extra small. Look how small and tiny that little sucker is. And again extremely soft I like that a lot so you guys at Art of Sopus you've as you can tell I don't know if you can see it on in the frame a lot of my brushes these as you can see are utter tra these are like the worst I don't even know where I, I think I got these like a four four or five they don't even have a name written on them anymore that's how old these are I barely use those. I've got my army painter brushes. Uh, I've got some other, a, a China brush, literally says China on the brush. That's all it says on there, China. And then some Home Depot, or Home, Home Depot, yeah. Anyway, so there we go. I will hopefully, Maybe tonight I may get into painting this with these and follow the the way the uh... Ooh, that's got a lot of dust on there. Anyway, so maybe my next video will be painting that with my new brushes that I'm excited about having. Thanks for taking this trip with me. Add that to the other case that's hidden over there. Y'all have a great day. Thanks a lot for watching.